Hello, my name is Troy West. I'm a custom saddle maker. I've been building saddles for 40 years. I build saddles and saddle trees. And uh, a common problem in uh, saddles is uh, a broken tree. Uh, and uh, you may suspect you have a broken tree, your horse may be hurting. Or if you actually saw a horse flip on a saddle and you may suspect that it's broken. Uh, this is the way to check it. That's that's pretty easy. Uh, typical saddle tree is going to break right here in the narrowest, thinnest part of the bar. Uh, especially on a rawhide tree, there will be a row of nails either side of it, and this is the most common place that a tree will break. And uh, so, what you want to do, of course, this would, this would have all the leather on it still, but I'm showing you with a with a bare tree. You just take that saddle and set it down on its nose, just like that. And uh, preferably on a flat surface like concrete, if you if you can, and then just put all your weight on it and push down, and with all your weight. And if that thing is broken, it should have a lot of gill right there, and you would see you would see that thing given. Another problem that can happen uh, is if the candle has separated from the bars in the back, there will also be a lot of wiggle. Sometimes it's difficult to tell whether the bar is broken or the candle is separated. Either way, if it has done either of those things, it should show up with a lot of give and wiggle. And it's time to go see your local saddle maker.